Hi everyone, my name is George and welcome to the Anime Grove. Today we're watching The God of High School episode 11. Last episode was crazy, we found out that Ilpio, Park Ilpio is actually the key and he's been like possessed by some kind of kitsune spirit, a uh, fox. Uh, it appears Jedal or Jegal, I still don't know what his name is, is or was associated with Nox. Uh, we also saw a fight between uh, Mujin and the boss of Nox, I can't really remember his name, and how another one of the six, I think he was part of the six, helped him by using his national treasure. It was incredible. It, I think it was my favorite episode so far. Amazing. Also, the fight between uh, O and... Uh, O and Q versus the whole world. I think it was O and Q. <laughs> now I'm bugging. Uh, yeah, we also got to see a few more chariots, just like, like for example, our protagonist chariot. And uh, yeah, I think that was it. I'm so eager. Let's get into it. This is not a market substitute, so grab your legal copy and watch it along with me. Remember to like, comment and subscribe for more content in this channel. Now, without any further ado, let's get into it. So the Kitsune is from heaven. An ancient Kitsune. So it was incredibly powerful. What happened to that god? Is that the Chariok god? Or is it like God God? So it was sleeping and I think it was sleeping inside Ilpia. What's going to happen now? I forgot they were still battling. So who's going to win now? Uh, our protagonist or the key? His teeth or fangs growing? On his skin. That's the hair guy, the one I thought was the. What happened to him right now? Oh, he was resonating. So everyone can feel it. Damn, this is tense. I think. Then. It, I think she was P. P is hurt. What's going to happen to her? <laughs> She's simping. <laughs> is he aware he's just turned into half fox? <laughs> he's so cool, by the way. Flaming tails. There's some kind of barrier? He can launch his attacks. That sounded gnarly. Let's go. He disappeared. He's using Tekken, so he's using every technique he's seen so far, kind of. Techniques from almost every person he's fought so far. Wow, is it done? Is it over? He's so strong. Wait. Does he get damage when he's... On that state for a long time. Oh, it was wearing off. Right, it, he still must have fire powers. Oh my god, that was insane. Let's go. The music is insane too. I love it. Gotta download this, download this soundtrack. 
You gotta develop your own. Don't give up, Mori. Let's go. Yo. Look at the visuals. Not even Fire Force. Let's go. Fire Okami. Fire Wolves. Wait. Is it? Not even moving. Just styling on him. I don't understand the thing. <laughs> Did he just develop his chariot? Wait. Why is he so bad? So, you know what I mean. What ha What's happening to him? It's like all three of them are awakening now. Ilpio, the hair guy, the baton guy, I mean, and Mori. Ilpio scared? Night Parade of Hundred Demons. Is that a spear? It's like a storm. This escalated so much. Dog, weren't you in a on, inside a building? Oh my god! That was amazing. I'm still not sure about what Morris Cherio gives. Is he okay? He is off. That wasn't Cherio. So what happens to him now that Nox knows he's the key? Are they going to kill him? <laughs> QB. That's rude, man. <sighs> Dirty. What is done? Right, the monks. I hope nothing happens to them. What about the traitor men? One of the organizers, the commissioners, all seemed weird right now. She was acting weird. And also the blonde guy seemed to be realizing something as he looked at the red haired guy that was suddenly smiling and looking, suddenly smiling and looking at him. Man. So friendly. I'm glad to see he's on a better mood. It feels weird, I think. How can you be guarding someone and leave the window open? Clear. You know what I mean? This is a clear shot. Yeah, that's what I want to know. This guy la has some lifeless eyes. Yeah. Don't back, don't face away from the window. No, man. I'm so nervous.
wait, what's this? Why is so this is where the guy, this guy, I don't know his name, I want to know his name, I don't know how to address him. Is he like cursed or possessed? Wait, look at his eye. He's going to attack her, right? Are they going to be okay now that they're not in the arena? I hope they are. She seems dead and he's absorbing her? What's even going on? Jean Jugok. A bit too late, I believe. I'm guessing those people are dead. Oof. But I don't think the nanobots are working here because then Kang the I think Kang the her wouldn't be dead in case she's dead. It looks like the thing film. So she's alive. So the nanobots do work. No, don't absorb him. Is he going to recognize her? Young Dan. Did he just... Man, that was an awful ending for that guy. <gasps> what? Huh? Her leg? What the fuck? What the fuck, man? Was it Jegel? Or was that Jean? Fuck. It's one after the other. <laughs> Ten million each? What happened to them? Did Jegal do this? I think so. Yeah, he's a complete asshole. I mean, he's beyond any level I even thought possible. That's not fire. That's like dark energy. Can he be corrupted? Maybe? It's over. So that was it for episode 11 of the God of High School. <laughs> wow, it gets crazier and crazier. It's like, there's no end. So now he's dead for real. John, I learned his name right as he was about to die. That sucks as, that sucks a lot. So, ah, that was so gruesome the way Jedi I swear I gotta check what the correct name is, or please someone let me know in the comments. Uh, I didn't expect him to just bite half of John's body off and eat it. I mean, and he even cut uh, Ilpio's friend's arm and leg. Well, he sucks! I mean, he sucks! 
but I love his jerry, but he still sucks. The fight between Ilpio and Mori was incredible. Uh, how can... The animation was amazing. And what was it that helped Jin win? I mean, Mori win. I mean, he didn't use Cherryok, I believe. So I thought it was Cherryok, but the way they talked about it afterwards, the guy who lost his leg, and no, his arm, the guy who lost his arm, when he was addressing that with uh, Mori, Mori seemed to say it wasn't Cherryok, but he wasn't sure. So I'm even more curious now to know then what is Mori, because he seems to be like some kind of key, and either Mori or Ilpio seems to have corrupted Jan, and that's what caused him to go dark. Man, I don't know. I was so sure something bad was going to happen to Ilpio when he was facing away from the window that I kind of <laughs> missed the emotion of the moment because I was too tense, so I have to rewatch it. But anyways, that was it, guys, for episode 11 of The God of High School. I hope you liked it, and hopefully I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye.